Well, last night, the Democracy Now! team rushed down to Zuccotti Park to cover the police crackdown. It began just after 1 a.m. We were there until the early hours of the morning coming in to do this broadcast. We witnessed the arrests in the streets and made it into the square just as police were dismantling the tents as well as sanitation workers and hauling away protesters' belongings in dump trucks. This is our report. Uh, tell us your name if you want to, and, and then what happened. Uh, my name is Alex Hall, and um, I, I basically heard a tip from reporters. They were outside of the park about an hour before it happened, and um, we asked them, "Hey, what's going on?" And they said the cops are planning on, you know, clearing the whole park out. So, you know, an hour later, they um, they basically surrounded the park, at least at least 100 to 200 cops, and um, with the um, shields on that were across their faces, and um, they basically put up two. They put up huge beams of light into the park on every side. They had about three beams on every side of the park. It got super bright, and um, they came with a loudspeaker. There was a ton of them, at least 100 to 200. And they um, they lined up in front of the park, on all sides of the park, but they lined up in the front on um, Trinity Avenue, and they came with a loudspeaker. They said, listen, we're going to need you guys to clear the park. We're going to take out the tents and get the sanitation team in here, and you can come back to the park without your tents. You won't be able to have your tents in the park. And um, they basically started pushing people. They started tearing down tents. They started to break them down. And uh, without even checking if anybody was in the tents, but they started pushing everybody around. Every without checking if anybody was inside the tents, they started just breaking them down? They basically started pulling them and stepping on them, yeah. And um, everybody started to leave the park. And um, this is where we are, basically. Everybody kind of rushed out. They started pepper spraying people. I got, I had milk here. I actually was helping somebody get the, the spray out of their eyes. And um, this is where we are right now. Please clear the street and the sidewalk. Where are we supposed to go? Where do we go? Don't block the street. Keep the there's a, there's a cop station over here. So now we're still on the sidewalk, and police are pushing these protesters back. They told us to get off the street, so people complied, and now we're being pushed further and further away from Zuccotti Park, from Liberty Plaza, where just moments ago, protesters were cleared. Hey, Hero, what's going on? We're sitting here, they're trying to block, they're pushing us to the wall. I got pepper spray straight in the face. You see, I'm still, I'm still looking. They can't stop me. They can't stop us. This is a sign. He pepper sprayed me straight like that. You see this? You see this? Twice. Twice I'm pepper sprayed, and I'm still looking at you, part and clear. This is a piece Sure and clear, I'm still staring at you. That's a sign that they can't stop us, that we all see what's really going on, and that they can't blind us. They can't pull water over our eyes. They can't put nothing in our eyes that's going to blind what's going on here. And the same goes for all the people who are out there. Where were you when the police first moved in? I was two blocks away. Two blocks away. Didn't know what was going on. And then the, my, I got a phone call. Where are you at? We're being raided. So I had to run to this, straight into this. And what do you tell people right now? What do I tell people? That this is ridiculous. Soon, soon, we're coming back. We're, they're not leaving. That's, get that straight right now. We're not going nowhere. A lot of us is going to be here overnight. A lot of us will be here for the rest of the week. A lot of us will be here until the new year comes. A lot of us will be here until we see a new day, and that will, that's, you can quote me on that. So tell me what happened. Uh, I was standing on the outside of the crowd. They started really beating up on this girl pretty badly with the riot shield, and while people tried to pull her out, they sprayed pepper spray, like, directly into this little clump of people. I was right on the side, but I'm okay. So what's going on now is a familiar scene. We're getting pushed farther and farther away from Zuccotti Park. At every block, police are saying the protesters who uh, have the choice to be arrested or move further and further away. Where do they move to? Where do they move to? So this uh, commanding officer right here telling everyone to push people further away. Now it looks like everyone on the inside here is going to be uh, is going to be arrested. Look at Somebody arrested right in front of me. So now we're back where we started off, a block from Zuccotti Park. When we got here, 
there were throng, throngs of demonstrators protesting the uh, raiding of Zuccotti Park, Liberty Plaza. They were pushed further and further away. Activists that were on the sidewalk were told to keep moving down, and they were asking where she would go, and they were just told to move. And what we witnessed was a very forceful interaction with uh, police even refusing to tolerate activists staying on the sidewalk, obviously wanting to get people as far away from Zuccotti Park as possible. And so now we're seeing these trucks behind us pulling away. They've arrested many people. And so as we tried to come back here to this area just a block from Zuccotti Park, we spoke to one of the activists that had been arrested. Hey, tell me what happened. Um, I was being pushed and shoved, and I had no way to move. And the lady firsthand singled me out and pinned me down and said that her arrest her, put, pushed me face down into the sidewalk, and now I'm arrested. So tell us what happened. Um, it's your typical breakup of any protest. Um, just a little bit peace, more peaceful done than a little bit others. I mean, uh, bottom line is during the day, um, the officers started up, ended up putting on their gear, kind of first inquiry that something might happen. Then all the vendors that were around should have been closed like any other given day. Like they're closing up, but they all did it at once. Something was going on. Next thing you know. We're told to leave the park. Fly, uh, flyers are being handed out, telling us the reasons of which, why, and that the tent's going to go, grab our belongings, to vacate as quickly as possible. And then the blue horn started coming on. People started, uh, the announcement started coming. If you're going to go, go ahead and go. If you're going to stand and you're going you're gonna to hold our ground, they're going to be in the kitchen area. So they all in, are in a soft lock arm right now. How many are in there right now? Uh, I'm going to say there's roughly about, give or take, 250. Protesters, then how many police? Um, I'm going to say there's maybe three police officers at least for every, uh, for every protester. And tell us what you saw with the tents. We were hearing that police had announced they were coming in to clear the tents. Um, from my visual observations, from what I can tell, um, simply they would push in a little bit, sorry, they push in a little bit and they would start ripping tents out.